show you the different types of liners that you can use on your diapers. Uh, there's multiple reasons why you would you would want to use liners or why people really like using liners. So I just kind of wanted to show you some of the different kinds and what we like and what works for us. So right here, these two are both disposable liners and then these are reusable ones and these are micro fleece, which I will get into those in a second. First, I wanted to talk about the disposable ones. Now these ones are G diapers, which... I just have these because Baby Zara sold them and I needed them like ASAP and I couldn't wait for shipping so I bought them and they were around eight to nine dollars and there is 105 of them in the box so they would last you a while. It does come out to be around 12 cents a piece for each liner but they are fairly large. They're pretty big <laughs> compared to the other ones that we have used and they kind of have a they're not as soft as I would prefer the liners to be but when you put them on a diaper so like for the smart bottoms it would cover it completely and we used these on our last vacation and I don't I don't like them. I, I just, they're too big. So when I'd put it on her, you know, and I'd go to change her again, like the whole thing would just be crumpled like this. And it was kind of starting to deteriorate a little bit onto her just from the wetness. And I didn't like that. So I, I'm not a big fan of these ones. The other disposable liners were the Viva paper towels. So I'd, I ran out of the G diaper ones. I didn't take enough with me on vacation. And so we stopped at Meyer and got some of these. Now we bought a six pack of them, but I think one roll of these, it's uh, like 88 sheets and one roll is about $2. So you're looking at around two cents a piece uh, for the liners there. And as you can see, it's still, it's actually a lot wider than the uh, G diaper ones, but it is shorter. They are soft, they get the job done, and um, they just work really well for us. But we did like these, and for a lot cheaper route, you can get a whole roll of them, and they work amazing. Now, I will th mention that with the disposable liners, I do not throw these away. I don't flush them down the toilet. Um, especially the paper towels, but these ones, I think they tell you that you can flush them. Yeah, flushable and biodegradable, but I just don't, I don't mess with septic stuff. So, you know, toilet paper is the only thing that goes down. But when we were at like rest stops and stuff, I would flush them down because I didn't have anywhere else to put them. But if you are looking for a cheap route, disposable liners route, I would I would go with the, the paper towels because they, they work really good and they're cheap. Other types of liners you can use um, are the reusable micro fleece ones. We really love our fleece liners and these were the first ones that I made myself and they just aren't cutting it now. I tried the Smart Bottoms ones and I just love these. So we use these all the time. They fit right into the diaper perfectly. Just absolutely perfect. And you know, if anything were to shoot up the back, it's usually covered because the liner goes all the way up there and they're soft, super soft. And they keep my daughter dry too, which I really, really like. Um, I just love these liners and usually I don't have any poo that ever gets on the diapers. So I don't really have to worry about stains. I'm not, I'm not too worried about stains, but I never have to worry about that. And with the liners, like if she does go poo, I just grab it like this, drop it in the toilet and rinse this off and then just put it in the diaper and put it in the uh, wet bag until laundry day. So they work really well for us. The ones that I made which you can make your own as well and just know the dimensions that you want them. I just kind of just winged it and this is what I end up with. So it kind of just covers that and I 
in my experience it always comes over here or it goes up the back and it's just they're they were pointless because they weren't containing it all like I wanted it to so a lot of people use the liners um, they'll use the micro fleece liners if their children have a wetness sensitivity um, since these don't have anything that wicks it away because it's just all cotton um, but people will use them for that they will use them because they don't like stains and these work really well to keep stains at a minimal and I know for us I just use it because it's easier to clean the poopy diapers when she goes so every diaper that um, I put her in has one of these we have enough that yeah but and then I also wanted to mention real quick when we were on vacation I used the liners and a disposable one because I didn't have my diaper sprayer and so usually I'd do that and it just worked out really well so anything that this didn't catch this caught so then I could just wash that in the washer when I washed my laundries so we really like the fleece liners and the Viva paper towels for the disposable liners um, if you guys haven't already checked out one of these options and you're interested in it I highly recommend these two um, I know that there are some few other disposable brands of liners out on the market I just haven't tried them this is just what we've tried and what has worked for us and I just wanted to share that with you I hope you guys enjoyed this video and be sure to give it a thumbs up and I'll talk to you guys later